Konnichiwa, Rokori Tachi here, and welcome to my Christmas haul for 2013. So we're going to kick off with this little tapestry that I picked up from Mandarake. It is the Little Busters characters. I saw this and I literally went, wow, that is really awesome. I really love that. Couldn't resist buying it straight away. So it's very, very small, to be honest with you. Like I said, it is very small. If I sort of move back a bit further, do a bit of a zoom in so you can still see it. You can see just in comparison that it is actually really, really small, but still really small, but really cool. So that is the first thing. Let's move on to the second thing. Okay, so the second thing I picked up was this Boa Hancock Daiki Makara. I saw this on eBay from the Italian seller and I thought, do you know what? I'm going to take a chance on it because it was £60. I know that there are a lot, and I mean a lot, of bootleg Daiki Makaras about, but this one I couldn't resist to be honest with you. There's no point in me showing you the other side because it's exactly the same. This usually comes as a double set. But I couldn't resist uh, picking her up for, like I said, £60 for the single. So really, really awesome stuff. And it is official as well. Hands got down here. If I take it down here, uh, there we are. There's the One Piece uh, label. And there's the Toei sticker on there as well, if you can see it. So yeah, it is official. If you are interested, I believe the seller has still got some. Um, it's the Italian seller on eBay. Just type in Boa Hancock uh, Cushion and it should pop up. So that is uh, the second thing. Let's move on to the rest of the stuff I picked up in December and for Christmas. So here we are in the computer room for the update of the DVDs and what else I got for Christmas. And you're probably thinking, hang on a minute, there's a ship missing. Yes, there is a ship missing in the background because the Thousand Sunny, the rigging's gone on it. So it's gone off for repairs. So anyway, let's move on to what I've got, um, well, what I picked up rather in December before we get on to the Christmas stuff. So as you can see here we've got Gantz. Um, I picked this up from Play.com, MVM again with their awesome deals of 9.99. Fantastic that MVM do these practically every week, 9.99 a series. You know, you've got about eight uh, discs in there or six discs in there and you'll get a whole entire series for 9.99. So kudos to MVM because they are doing an absolutely fantastic job doing that. There are seven discs in this one. So to pick, the, pick it up for 9.99 again awesome bargain so that's Gantz. I also picked up um, from Blaze Vincent uh, recommendation was Okami-san and her companions of his or uh, her seven companions now I got this off of eBay for £25 and I believe it was off the same seller that uh, Blaze Vincent got some of his bargains as well and this is the Blu-ray DVD art box uh, set as well so this is a chip um, chipboard box so if I sort of take the box out you can hear and you can see that that is a really nice quality box as well it really is it's a really nice quality box of Okami so let's move it around that way so you can see that and there we are so that is the box um, I'll give you a quick look at the DVDs as well so here this is the blu-ray so here is the cover and here is the discs as well and the back I'm hoping that's still zoomed in on the actual item because we don't want it zooming out so let's do that again there we are so that's the blu-ray if I just move that one over there and this is the DVD again you know really really nice set uh, to be honest with you and I got it for £25 off of play.com uh, not play uh, play.com, eBay rather. My mind has blanked. <laughs> I got it off of eBay, off of the same seller I feel, I think it was the one that uh, Blaze Vincent got a lot of his bargains from. That seller sold some ridiculous amount of anime at some really ridiculous prices, so we lucked out on that one. So there we are, that's Okami san and her seven companions. I also got this and I've watched it already and I absolutely loved it, and that is Anohana, the flower we saw that day. This moved me to tears beyond recognition, to be honest with you. When um, you get my review on Anohana, you'll see what I mean. But when I watched this show, it was absolutely fantastic. It really was. Now, unfortunately, my one's got a little bit of damage up here, as you can see. So I was a bit annoyed about that. I almost swore them. <laughs> but I was really, really a bit miffed, to be honest with you. So, um, 
All in all, I will say though that I really, really enjoyed this series and I highly, highly recommend it. And of course, you will get the review on it very, very soon. So that was Anna Hannah. Uh, picked that one up off of UP1 for about £30. Uh, I also picked up, um, again, I couldn't resist picking this one up. I saw it on UP1 for about £15 and that is Strong World. I could not resist this because Strong World... It's one of those films that I've really, really wanted to see. And again, I heard from uh, Blaze Vincent that it's an absolutely fantastic film. So I'm really looking forward to watching this. Of course, One Piece, I love it. So I'm really happy that they've finally re released uh, one of the films in Europe anyway, at least. Uh, I believe actually this is an American one. So not in Europe, but um, in America. We have got The Strong World. Maybe they might start releasing the other movies. It would be good if they could do that because I know we've got movie two and I think movie four, but they are like retellings of uh, arcs that have already happened in the story. I want to see some of the other films being released, like Film Z and Romance Dawn. So we'll have to see what happens with that. But there we are, that's Strong World. Now, on to the stuff I got for Christmas. So, kicking off, uh, these are all from my sister and my mother, by the way. Uh, I got Sword Art Online, part one. And I've heard a lot about this show. I've heard that it's actually really, really good. And I've also been told that once I watch it, I will want an Asuna figure. So I know there's a lot of Asuna figures out there, so I've got quite a choice. <laughs> but I have heard really good things about this, so I'm really looking forward to watching the Sword Art Online. I'll pop that one there. Um, also got uh, Naruto Shippuden Box Set 15. And I've heard from Neo Magazine when I read it that... Uh, this is entirely filler. And I went, oh no, not filler. Yeah, Naruto Shippuden Box Set 15 is entirely filler. Um, apparently it's reasonable filler, but it is entirely filler. So I got that. I also got Bleach Series 12 Part 1. Looking forward to watching a lot more Bleach uh, because I enjoyed what I've seen of Series 11 so far. It's really getting cool. So I'm hoping that this continues on that path. Let's hope there's no fillers in this one. Fingers crossed that there isn't. <laughs> because I really, really am enjoying Bleach at the moment. And it's in a really good place as well. So I really recommend picking it up and getting back into it if you can. If you've gone off of it, it actually does get really good. Um, another show that I have finished this year, and you will see the review very soon, and that is Berserk. So I actually got Berserk Movie 1, The Egg of the King. I'm looking forward to seeing this because I really enjoyed the TV series and I want to see what they've done with it movie-wise but I won't watch it until next year because I feel that too, a bit too soon it might change my perception or the way I see the show so I feel that it's definitely one that I will watch uh, maybe early next year, maybe later next year we'll have to see but I'm hoping now that I can pick up a movie number two so that's that one, pull that back up there uh, this one I got from Sir Blaze Vincent. Yes, I've knighted him now. He's a Sir. And he knocked me for six when I opened this because he got me Genshin King DX. This is uh, Series 1 and the OVA collection. This really, really did surprise me. And this is the kind of show that I absolutely would love, to be honest with you. He's absolutely got it right on the money because it's all about anime, it's all about manga, and it's all about figures as well. So, as you can see, we've got some figures up here. Uh, so I'm really, really looking forward to watching this as it is about otakus, which is just like I said, it's my kind of show. So yeah, thank you very much, uh, Blaze, for that. You are really awesome, sir. I really, really appreciate it. Um, I will say this one is from Anime Works, as you can see, which I think is to do with Media Blasters, but don't quote me on that, but I will ask Blaze because I think he would know. So awesome present there from Blaze Vincent. Uh, also, moving on to, again, more my mum and my sister bought me uh, from up on Poppy Hill. Again, Studio Ghibli Awesomeness. Looking forward to watching this because uh, I love my Studio Ghibli films. And I've heard that this is actually a really, really good one. So I was really surprised to receive this as well. I'm hoping that I'm zoomed in and you can see this. That's better. Um, I also got another surprising one, and that was Wolf Children as well. I've heard that this is a really, really good film as well. I've heard that it's very emotional, very dramatic, you know, it's got a very sort of kind of um, heart-wrenching stuff in it. Uh, I think it's going to be a bit of a weepy one, to be honest with you, but what I've heard it is an absolutely fantastic film, so I'm really looking forward to watching this as well. 
and I also got Dragon Ball Z Series 1. Now I have spoken to Davy Bunch of Numbers and he was telling me that Manga UK are re-releasing -re Dragon Ball Z. And I was like, really? Because they're also re-releasing the original series of Naruto, so maybe they're just trying to cash in again on these big series. But I'm hoping that if they do re-release Dragon Ball Z, then perhaps these ones, uh, which I've got to get, might go down in price. That's my hope anyway. So that's uh, Dragon Ball Z Series 1. And finally, I got Fairy Tail Collection 5. So some more Fairy Tail awesomeness. Really looking forward to uh, getting back into this show because I really, really enjoyed it up to the episode 48. So I can now move on a little bit more and see what's happening with Fairy Tail. But I really, really loved it and I highly, highly recommend it. And finally, my sister bought me this really, really awesome book as well, which is all to do with anime and manga. And I was really, really surprised when she gave me this. Sorry, jogging the camera there. Uh, because she said she saw this and she picked it up for me. And it's all about sort of anime and it's all about the characters as well. If I sort of take the camera back here, you might be able to see a little bit better. So there we are. It's a really, really awesome book, to be honest with you. So if I do a little bit of a flick on here, you can see that it's got interesting place for me to stop there. <laughs> uh, all different anime in it, and it's got all different... Uh, all about the different directors and the producers and characters, and uh, it's really, really cool. So I'm really looking forward to having a read through this. It's a really awesome book, to be honest with you. So... We've got quite a lot in there, as you can see already, that I'm sort of just skipping through here. So yeah, it's all about um, Wata, Watanabe Shinjiro. Of course, we know the creator of Cowboy Bebop, which is awesomeness. So yeah, it's a really, really cool book, and I was really surprised she got me that. That's the, uh, I should say that's the front cover, you didn't see that, so there we go. Um, yeah, that was a surprise from my sister, and it was quite a good surprise as well, because it's not something I was expecting, so really pleased with that. And then finally, I got uh, non-anime related, Keen, uh, from my mother, the best uh, the best of, which, uh, to be honest with you, I wanted CD2 of this, and not CD1, because I've already got all that, but I wanted CD2, because this is all B-sides that I've never heard, so looking forward to listening to that. So, in anime, everything I got, if I can pile that up, is all them, all them, and of course, the book as well, which I won't put on there, and the CD, and everything else I've shown you as well. Of course, stay tuned for the figure update, because there is a figure update coming. I got a, f a lot of figures for December, as well as some for Christmas as well, so stay tuned for that. And it just leaves me to say the usual, thanks for watching, sayonara.